everyone, it's Jojo from Mojo Dojo Plans, and today I'm going to be making an extra sheet to stick in my planner. One thing that I'm wanting to really keep track of as we've moved into our own house, you know, we're responsible for all the things on our own before we used to share, you know, like a lot of like things that we needed for the house with my parents, but now it's just on us, and I'm really trying to like get better at budgeting like where we need, like when we need to being able to buy stuff, um, you know, things like toilet paper and just like extra like deodorant, like when toothpaste goes on sale, like literally like just all those types of like adulting things. So I thought it'd be fun to make a sheet kind of like a last time I, I actually made one of these like a long time ago and I know a lot of other planners have made them and I haven't done it since. Um, but I feel like it'll be really nice to like have like a last time I kind of thing. That way I can put, um, you know, I could just put things down like, what am I using? Like how, like how long does it take us to like get through all this stuff before like I need to buy it again? Or like, great, I'm buying toilet paper like in bulk from Costco like every three months. Like those things I kind of want to know because like honestly when they're on sale I kind of want to just like buy them and then that way like towards the end of the year I won't be buying anything because I've already stocked up because I know how often we go through those things. Um, so I just wanted to make a fun sheet and I pulled out this book it's volume four from Kel the Plan of Her Lettered Words, and it had this adulting sticker, and I thought it would be really fun to make a currently adulting because she has the word currently in here in nice big letters somewhere if I can find it. There it is. And so I thought it'd be fun to do like currently adulting and just like make a fun, cute little sheet for this. So we're going to put like these two words together like this is what I'm doing in my life I'm currently adulting but you know I gotta make it pretty so I pulled out live love posh's posh summer and I found these florals because I haven't I haven't even used them yet guys like what is going on so I'm gonna use these so I'm gonna pull this out I haven't punched this paper yet it is just a regular sheet of paper and then I'll punch it later but I just didn't want to punch it in case I'm gonna put I might put stuff down the side that I'm going to punch, but I also don't know. So I think this is going to end up being a back and front kind of page just to give me like lots of room. So let's get this really pretty clear sticker on here. Uh, it just like makes everything better. <laughs> okay. And then I have a piece that can kind of go on the side, but not be like the star. So I think I'm going to do this because then I can do like currently adulting next to it. So this will be the side that gets punched. And then I'm going to take that currently. And then adulting. Mm, don't want them to run into each other too much. Okay. So I have currently adulting and then I think I'm gonna punch on this side but again I think this is gonna be a back and front kind of page because I just literally took up 90% of my space so <laughs> kudos to me okay so let's go in with some boxes I think I'm gonna grab pastel and maybe we can pull in a pinky color I'm probably gonna be pulling in a lot of different books I'm gonna use the ones with lines um, just cuz that'll give me more things right and really I'll just be writing dates so I'm gonna do a box to write the dates in so we'll do one up here so let's put that like right about there and then I'm gonna do a header on it and that way I can write like toilet paper and then from there all I'll need to do is write all my dates down so like you know I could do that so this will be like the header for that and then all the dates so you can see why this is going to be going over to another page because I'm gonna end up taking up a good majority of this and I feel like we can do purple so let's do purple because why not let me make sure I get my header in here if I can pull it out let's like line these ones up because your girl's a little OCD uh, right about there I love it and then I can put like a couple going in um maybe I feel like this blue color goes really well but I don't have a oh goodness I set aside a backup <laughs> 
Okay. Uh, okay, there we go. There we go, because I feel like this color goes really well. So I'm going to kind of try to put them close. That way I have room for, like, at least one more over here. So I'm going to lay this down as straight as I can. Although that other one was not straight at all. 100%. Okay, so I think this is my color scheme. I think I can add green, and then I think after that, those may be my colors. So yeah, let's get green in here. Should I do the mint? Hold on. I know I don't need this one. I'm just trying to see. I feel like the mint would be better. I love the bright green in here, but mint might be the way to go. Or should I do the bright green? Nah, I guess I'm going to do the bright green. I lied, I lied. So I'm going to try to put this as close to here as possible because I'm hoping I have room for like one more. No, I'm not going to have room for one more. That's okay. We'll do decoration. It's all good. The other side won't have like nearly as much decorating on it, so I'll have a lot more room over there. So I'm not too worried. I think it looks so pretty, just like an intro page to it. I love it. Okay, let me flip it over. Let's put some on the other side. I'm going to do very minimal decoration. I do want to put the florals on the other side because I feel like it'll look weird if, like, the front only has decoration and then the back has nothing. So I am going to just add little baby florals and then we'll focus like the rest of the space will be for that oh you know what we can't even use double wides check this out okay this is the right side right i'm not okay i'm not punching on this side i was like oh no i just have to remember i gotta punch the other side so don't get too carried away let me put this down because i forget the header has to go there i am not putting these down straight to save my life come on there we go. Okay, then we can do this for the header because I'm only putting dates. So we can do two in here and save some room, maybe two like similar items, right? And then let me find my ruler. And I'm just going to draw a line. And then, boom, I just gave myself so much more room. And now I can go back and use all those colors because I think I have the double white available in all of these. Oh, dang it. I'm still using my backup. I should have switched when I did the green. <laughs> Oopsies. Okay, so I want to make sure... I'm not getting in the way of where it's going to get punched. So I'm going to do it right about there. I'm going to do the exact same thing. This over ever so slightly so it can fit a little bit better. Okay, same thing. Just gave myself some extra space without having to use as many stickers. I'm kind of limited on how many of each one I have, but that's okay. Okay, let me see if I have, I have the quick one. I do. Did I use the dark one? I did. No. Did you just see what happened just now? Mind of its own. So rude. Okay, I keep forgetting I have to put down the, the headers so I can't get too close wanting to put it a lot closer than I can okay and then we'll do the two headers so that way I know what those are for and we draw the line boom because all I'm writing in there is dates and then the last color I need is just the pink Did I use the dark pink? Yes. 
<laughs> I already don't remember what I did. Shows you where my brain goes all the time. Losing it. Nice. So I just gave myself eight more spots on the back of things that I can write and keep track of. So I'm happy with that. And then we can add like a little extra floral on this side just to pull it all together because I do have a little bit left. I feel like this bigger one will be better over here. And I can almost cut it in half. So I'm going to do this there. Trim it. put the other part that's going to get punched but at least that adds a little bit more floral on that side I feel like I need some quotes over there okay and then I have another bundle and then like another little corner piece and then I'll be done with this whole sheet of stickers I'm so proud of myself I've come so far I used to like not want to have anything to do with using all my stickers in one go like hoarding 101. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put that in there and then maybe we can put I just want more floralies I guess on this side. So I'm gonna do half half trim it and then we'll do the other half. Just so I have a little bit more going along the sides. Just so I don't waste that one. Okay, there we go. So I think I can punch it now. I'm going to punch it and then see if I can make some space for a couple quotes. Gotta love when my punch decides to get sticky on me. I think that was the only one, yep. Yeah. There we go. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Like, who wouldn't want to adult with a cute sheet like that? Like, this makes me want to adult. Okay, so I'm going to go and use some stickers from Amber Plants Her Day. I'm going to use this Embrace Every Challenge. Mm, like, right in here. And I want, like see if there's like a somewhat long one this one works nothing changes if nothing changes if I can pick it up okay and then maybe like just a little bit on the other side I'm gonna use this be stronger than your excuses some quotes in there uh, let's see <laughs> I feel like this lister's got a list is pretty accurate okay I think that's good you guys I freaking love this sheet all right there we go there's my adulting sheet so again I'm going to be writing things like okay this one for sure we can do like toilet paper just for an example. Okay, and then I can write the dates here for when I bought them. So that's what I'll do. I'll go through, I gotta go through my closets. Um, I think everything for now, I think the first day I'm just gonna put is December because I like prepped for moving to our new house. So I'll just put everything as December for now and then the next time I buy it, then I can just keep updating this sheet. But just a fun way to use your stickers, you guys. I so hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I hope I'll see you in my next one. Bye!